Maybe you remember our video from last year, but you probably, probably you don't. don't. We ate weird Easter candy last year, and so we decided to make a part two for this year. And so we went to a few stores like Target and Walmart, and we found some weird looking candy, and then we're going to give them a try and see how that goes. Unfortunately, they didn't have any sour white chocolate again this year, so. I think that's fortunately. <laughs> I guess that one didn't uh, pan out for them. Anyway, let's do a little review of all the stuff we got and then we'll give it a little try. And then we're going to rate it one to 10 on aesthetics, one to 10 on interestingness, and one to 10 on taste factor. All right, so let's go through and take a look at everything. I think let's start with this weird anime bunny. Okay, first we have this weird Easter bunny. She's kind of anime and it's a marshmallow pop. Uh, it's not that weird, but we thought the design was interesting enough to include it. Next up, we have this Funfetti's jelly beans. And um, yeah, cupcake flavored jelly beans. That's kind of weird. Peeps have been doing weird things for the past few years. Actually, I don't know. Maybe they've been doing weird things all the time. This one's kind of tame though. It's party cake flavor. Thought it's weird that it's not called birthday cake, it's, but it's party cake for all your party needs. Again, with the peeps, this one is sparkly wild berry. Sounds pretty good. It's a, like a unicorn peep. And so it's, you know, got that aesthetic points. This one, it sounds pretty good. Uh, next up, we have the Donut Shop Coffee Peeps. So I guess it's just coffee flavor, but if there's some hint of donut, that would be a plus. <laughs> I don't know what Donut Shop is. Next up, we have Fruity Pebbles White Chocolate Bunny. This one looks pretty good. He accidentally got decapitated in transport. And then we have this white chocolate bunny and this one has popping candies in it. This one's not very Easter, but it was in the Easter section. So we're gonna review it anyway. It's a cotton candy burrito. Hey, it is Easter. Don't say that. It is? It's got jelly beans in it. Okay, well it's got jelly beans in it. So maybe it is Easter. And then next we have, or last we have, uh, it's not a sweet treat. It is a savory palate cleanser. We've got uh, cheddar cheese balls. All right, so first, what do we want to start with, Emily? Um, let's just eat all the peeps first. Yeah, probably. let's start with the peeps. Should we, yeah, let's do party cake. Yeah, party cake. I'm gonna open that one. All open. Yeah, Sparkly yeah. wild berry. Ooh, whoa. Smell that. Smells like jello or something oh, blue. Oh, <laughs> those are cute. These are super duper cute. These are the party cake peeps. Oh, this one's got a weird Ooh. eye. <laughs> Smell it. it, smells like it smells vanilla. Like sugar. It smells like birthday cake flavored chapstick. I think it mainly just tastes like a peep. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't had just normal peep for a while, but it kind of tastes just like a normal peep. It tastes peep pretty dang what normal. I remember. Maybe a little bit more vanilla. I think for aesthetics, I'd give them like a nine out of 10 because I think they're pretty dang cute. Yeah, they're very close to being a 10 out of 10. They look very nice. But most of their eyes are very wonky. So that's, that's like why I don't peeps. give it a 10 out of 10. <laughs> All right, so we did aesthetics. Interesting factor. Uh, Birthday cake flavored stuff has been done so many yeah, times. Yeah, maybe like before. a four. Yeah, like a four. Yeah. And then taste factor. I'd say like a six. Yeah, like they taste good. Standard peak like, flavor pretty yeah. much. Yeah. Yummy, but I don't know, pretty boring. They're pretty boring, yeah. Sparkly wild berry peeps. So these are supposed to be sparkly and... I mean, they're just as sparkly as every other peep. Yeah, maybe they tried to put some sparkle on there. Minimally more sparkly, I don't know. Yeah. So that's what they look like out of the package. <laughs> they're kind of sour. Mm-hmm. It's pretty gross. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, that's not the worst thing, sour. but it's, it's pretty sour. That's weird. Which it doesn't say anything about being sour on it, so that's kind of weird. Yeah, aesthetics. I give it a two out of 10. Come on. There's, it was barely sparkly. And the picture has a unicorn horn and, and it doesn't hair. even have a unicorn yeah. horn. They could have so. done like a sprinkle of like a unicorn horn or something, like, come on. Yeah. Awful. Um, interesting. I'd say these are more interesting than the last ones. Sparkly wild berry. I would say that that's like a five. Like a s seven. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Maybe. Okay. Six. We'll split the difference. Yeah, six. 
And then taste, I would give it like a, I'd say like a three. I'd say that the flavor's more interesting than the last one, but it's not better. So yeah. I'd say it's a, maybe a two. Yeah, let's just go with three. I'd pass on those ones, y'all. Like, I like sour candy, but I don't know. That's yeah. just kinda, I don't know. Sour marshmallow's kinda weird. And they should say it's sour if they're gonna yeah. make it sour. These are very covered in something. Ew, those look awful. <laughs> what the hell? They like really dumped the powder. You gotta take a look at this. Look. Okay, for one, their eyes are so wonky. Awful. Disgusting amounts of powder just dumped in there. These look so bad. Ew, the bottom's caked in dust. Yeah, they really, really coated these what ones. The flavor's not bad. I kind of like it. <laughs> It's really sweet though, with all that sugary stuff on it. Mm -hmm. Those are the best ones yet, though. Mm -hmm. It's still very freaking sweet, mm -hmm. but at least like the coffee kind of balances the sweetness just a little bit. Um. Okay. What was the first aesthetics? Awful. Zero out of ten. <laughs> I don't think the aesthetics were that. Mm. I don't That's know. That's not that bad. Yeah, their eyes are really high up on their head, and the nasty ch chunks of dust sprinkle yeah. jar. I don't think it makes them look gross, but. Oh, I think that looks disgusting. <laughs> <Or two. laughs> okay, I'll be nice and give it a one. Uh, interesting factor, coffee. Hmm, mm. coffee marshmallow though. I have never heard of that. Yeah, I think coffee flavor itself in things is not new. No. But in a children's item is new. Because that is these true. are usually is just weird. for kids. So it seems like they're trying to like get adults to eat them. I'd give that a six. Yeah interesting but not like revolutionary and taste i think these are the best ones yeah i give it a seven and a half yeah that's what i was thinking around mm -hmm. a seven it's yeah. still too sweet i think it's but still too sweet like yeah. can you it's a marshmallow covered in sugar so what do you expect yeah i don't want to eat the. let's eat the anime bunny last i can't do marshmallow <laughs> for a while let's though. do these jelly beans. i'm already feeling so nasty i know me too i think that's in focus <laughs> They're falling out of my hand. No, you have to pull it back a little bit. They it won't be able to do that close. Is that good enough? Yeah. Is that in focus? Yeah, they're pretty fun looking. They're pretty fun. They're pretty fun, Fetty. Uh, no, I'm only gonna do one. My braces can't handle. Tastes nothing like fun, Fetty. This is lies. I would say I. Uh... What is it? Does it have a flavor on here or just fun, Fetty? Well, fun, Fetty is birthday cake flavor, right? Vanilla. Yeah. And I guess that is vanilla flavor. It tastes like nothing to me. I give, they're very cute. I give it a- Like an eight or a nine, eight, I think. I'd say give it an eight out of 10. Yeah, yeah they're pretty cute. Mm -hmm. Some of the prettiest jelly beans I've seen in a while. They really match the Funfetti peeps. They do. Or the cake yeah. peeps, whatever. Funfetti's been done so many times. I give it a five. Mm. It's fine. Taste? What do you give it for taste? Like a five. I think it's pretty really average tasting. I give it like a three. <laughs> so that's average and at four. I mean, it, unless it's jelly bellies, I just don't like jelly beans. Very true. For yeah. jelly beans, I think they taste like an average jelly bean, so. Yeah. Um, next up are, oh, I already want to throw up and die. <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh, just, all of it's just so sweet. Yeah, that should be good. So this is Fruity Pebbles in white chocolate. Ooh, smell it. Ooh, it smells like just like I love, I love Rudy yeah. Pebbles. <laughs> My favorite. Weren't those like probably. the best peeps last year? <laughs> yeah, I like that, dude. That's not bad. That's my favorite thing we've eaten so far. Mm -hmm. That was pretty dang good. It's like <laughs> yeah. the cereal bars if you just like pumped up the chocolate aspect to like ninety. Yeah, I'm not lying. That's pretty good. Yeah, I actually <laughs> really, really like that. I mean, it tastes basically what you expect, but. But like a lot of white chocolate things taste awful. Yeah, that's that a pretty good white pretty chocolate. Good. All right, let's read it on aesthetics. It could look prettier. Yeah, it's pretty <laughs> average for uh, I chocolate. I give it like bunny. a four. That's fine. Yeah. So then interesting qualities is pretty normal. I would say it's like a six, right? Maybe like a seven. I don't okay. know. Cereal seven. and like, I've, I've never seen a, a chocolate bunny with cereal this in it. This is true, yeah. Okay, yeah, let's give that's it like a seven. I've never seen half. that. Taste, I give it like an eight and a half. Yeah, I'd say <laughs> like an eight and a half. Mm -hmm. 
Definitely still too sweet, but like, that's just, good. When you become an adult, things are just Everything's too sweet. Everything's just too sweet. <laughs> this is the Hop and Pop and Bunny. This is, rather than like a char- Rather than like a character bunny, it's more of like an atomically correct bunny, which I enjoy. And it's pretty dang cute, very sculptural. Yeah, I like the- Oh God, it's melting in my hands. I like the faint coloring. Like, I think we need a knife. Gosh, that tastes awful compared to the last one. <laughs> That's the fake white chocolate flavor. Yeah, it tastes like candy melt. Mm -hmm. It's popping a little bit, but not a lot. Um, Aesthetics, right. I would rate yeah. pretty high. Yeah, aesthetic. I, it's I love the sculpture aspect of it. It's beautiful. And I like how it's like <laughs> subtly speckled. Mm -hmm. So for aesthetics, I give it like eight and a half, mm -hmm. probably. Interestingness. <laughs> Interesting factor. Um, I'd say like a <laughs> seven or an eight. I don't know. Oh yeah, I'd say like, yeah, seven and a half. I've never seen Pop Rocks in a bunny, so. This is true. It's interesting. Um, taste, I give it like a five and a half. Yeah, like it doesn't taste bad, but it just kind of tastes like fake white chocolate. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow, the crunch. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. That was amazingly anticlimactic. I really thought it was just gonna fall out, but. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this looks <laughs> not very <laughs> awful. <laughs> Is there a oh, I love cotton candy though. Oh man. That jelly bean really ruined it for me. <laughs> cotton candy's pretty good. The cotton candy is just pretty good. I love cotton candy. <laughs> Can I tell a story? Mm -hmm. So once upon a time when I was in um, LA, in the LA area, I really, really want to go to a place and I think it's called Milk Bar over there because Sophia Nygaard went there and I saw her eat an ice cream burrito. <laughs> and so sorry, I was like, I'm like <laughs> casually choking over here. <laughs> okay. I'm and so you. I decided I had to go eat one. So I forced my friends to go and it was literally the most delicious thing I've ever had in my life. And that cotton candy burrito though was like freshly made cotton candy wrapped around homemade ice cream and then fruity pebbles inside. Obviously I love Fruity Pebbles, 10 out of 10. This one, not a 10 out of 10. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no way. Very different. <laughs> this one does something weird where it becomes like a hard chunk of sugar at the end though. Yeah, I have to like chew it. Normal cotton candy doesn't do that. Aesthetics. I mean, it was kind of so not, disappointing. Yeah. I give it like a two because it was so disappointing. It was amazingly disappointing. Like that reveal was like terrible. It was awful. And I get it manufacturing and stuff maybe. I don't know. I think they could have been done better anyway. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The interestingness, I give it an eight and a half out of 10. Very interesting. Mm -hmm. Cause I think this has become more of a popular thing but I haven't seen them like sold in stores. So yeah. pretty interesting. Taste, I give it like a, Three. Yeah, all together like a three. All together a three. The cotton candy was pretty good. The it's marshmallows a, yeah. were fine. They just tasted like Lucky Charms marshmallows. Yeah. The jelly beans were disgusting. Awful, disgusting, nasty. Uh, yeah. Is it time for the anime bunny? Yeah, anime bunny time. Okay, we're making this into a short so that I'm gonna be like <laughs> with my cell phone too. Today, wait, you should hold it. <laughs> Today we are going to um, rate this anime bunny we found at the store for Easter. On oh, bad. Yeah, really bad. Put it on wrong. I, you know, I can basically already. I already know what this tastes like before I even eat it. I know exactly. It's I just got a video of this. Do you want to hold it? Just like not up to your face, but just like. Here it is wrapped. Look at how beautiful. What is that like old flavor? <laughs> okay, so what do you give it for aesthetics? Um, one of the eyes was long. <laughs> so, so probably up. like a three. 
Yeah. It was a cute anime no, okay. bunny. I like the anime factor. I give it a five. Okay, five. If it was like, right, I could have given we'll it a We'll give it a four for in-betweens. What about uh, interestingness? I don't know. Character, <laughs> That's a hard one. A character marshmallows are so, so, like 10 years ago. Yeah. So I give it like... Like a two. A two. Um, and taste, I give it a one. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> a point five. It tasted oh, old. Good. It does. It tastes stale. Yeah, it was weird. So do not recommend anime marshmallow bunny awful thing. All right. Do recommend yeah. the cereal one. That's the, probably the only one mm -hmm. I recommend. That's the only one I recommend too. It's this one. Yeah. If you like Fruity Pebbles, I think you'd like it. That's our takeaway is that that's the one this holiday season to purchase at your local stores. All right. Thanks for watching this fun video. Um, we hope you have a happy Easter. Happy Easter. <laughs> happy Easter. <laughs> Okay, I think we should decide what to just throw away.